The same basic rule that applies to humidity applies to temperature. Stringed instruments are very sensitive to rapid changes in temperature. You want to avoid temperature fluctuations as much as you can. That means it's important to monitor the temperature of the room where you keep your instrument, as well as the outdoor temperature where you'll obviously, at some point, have to take your instrument. Simply put, you want to ease your instrument's transition from an indoor temperature to an outdoor temperature and vice versa. Your instrument struggles with transitions and you want the rate of temperature change to be as gradual as possible. For example, let's say the winters in your home state are icy, snowy, and downright miserable like they are here in Michigan. You can try two things to minimize temperature fluctuation. One, you may consider purchasing a cushy case cover for your instrument. Cushy case covers fit over your existing case, acting like a down blanket to protect your instrument and bow from rapid temperature changes. Two, you can arrive at a rehearsal a little earlier in the winter time in order to allow your instrument time to warm up to room temperature inside its case. Once your instrument has had a chance to warm up inside the case, you can then take it out and let it warm up in the room. Here's another care and maintenance tip on temperature. Temperature extremes on their own are also rough on stringed instruments. Excess heat may soften the varnish, which can then pick up impressions from your shoulder rest and case lining fabric. In more extreme cases, excess heat may also cause the instrument to stick to the inside of the case. Prolonged exposure to extreme cold can cause your varnish to crack and crackle, but it can also cause your instrument to crack. Obviously, in cold or warm climates, it's almost impossible to avoid subjecting an instrument to low or high temperatures. No matter where you live, you're going to have to take your instrument outside at some point. However, here are a few things you can do to protect your instrument from exposure to extreme temperatures. One, you can take care to avoid leaving your instrument in the direct sun or next to a heater. Even if your instrument is in its case, this will almost always damage your instrument and most likely your case as well. Sadly, this is a common mistake. Players leave their violin on top of a vent or even on top of a radiator and come back to a damaged instrument. Two, don't ever leave your instrument in your car or in your trunk. It's very easy for heat to get trapped in a vehicle as anyone who has come back to their car on a hot summer day knows. Your instrument will not fare well in these conditions. Likewise, leaving your instrument in your trunk while it's windy and cold outside is an equally bad idea. Cars are fairly adept at trapping heat even in milder seasons and are equally susceptible to the cold during winter months, so it's best to just get in the habit of keeping your instrument indoors in a temperature-controlled room. As always, if you have any questions about instrument care and maintenance, please post them in the comments section below. Thanks for watching.